What's up guys, today I'm going to be telling you what causes dry, red, itchy skin underneath your beard and I'm going to be doing that in exactly three seconds. Welcome back, my name is Jamie Cox, owner and founder of OP's Beard Co and today I'm going to tell you what causes red, itchy, dry skin underneath your beard. Now, many people misdiagnose what actually causes it, and I see some terrible advice flying around. And the most common piece of terrible advice that I see is to use beard oil if you've got dry, itchy, red skin. And that's wrong, and I'm going to tell you the reason it's wrong. The reason that's wrong is because you're suffering from putrosporum folliculitis. Now, this is a condition that's caused by naturally occurring yeast in your skin, getting into your hair follicle and generally running riot and giving you a yeast infection, a simple yeast infection. And the worst thing you can do for a yeast infection is make it worse by putting oils on it. Now, how do we treat this yeast infection and is there anything we can do about it? Now, most yeast infections are treatable you can get over-the-counter antifungal creams, shampoos, or you can even get a oral medication, much like what the ladies use to treat thrush, which is another fungal infection. Most fungal infections and yeast infections, shall I say, should clear up naturally. If you just lay off products, just make sure you're washing your skin, and most importantly, make sure you're drying your skin properly, giving a warm, damp environment creates a lot of fungal activity within your skin and that's pretty much going to give you more problems. But where the hell does it come from and is it something that I can get rid of completely? Now this is a benign but pretty challenging issue that you can have with your skin but once you make sure you've got the right things to sort it out it should be easy to keep on top of. It's also massively important that you don't misdiagnose it with acne. The difference between the two is that you, with acne, you don't get blackheads and you don't get whiteheads. So if you've got blackheads or whiteheads, then this is the issue you're suffering from. As I've said before, just make sure you get yourself the right antifungal creams or oral medication or shampoo to sort it out with and just keep on top of it. Make sure to look after your skin and your skin will look after you. <laughs> 